Hello, everyone. This is Felix from Coposphere Community. In this demo video, I'm going to show you a new feature in Coposphere 3.1, which is GitLab multi branch pipeline. As you can see, I already logged in to my Coposphere console with the account Project Regular. And I already invited this account to my project to my DevOps project with the role of operator. If you want to follow this demo video, you need to do the same thing. Before we go to practice, let's take a look at my GitLab repository. I have a public GitLab repository here, and I have ten tags, uh, ten branches here ready and also i have 10 tags here ready so let me go to my devops project and i'll create a demo pipeline click here and select gitlab here i'll just select the default gitlab server and then enter the owner of the GitLab repository and I will be able to select the Jenkins file multi-demo repository from the drop-down list here and remember if you want to use a private GitLab repository you have to configure a credential on the Jenkins dashboard in advance so that you can specify the credential here and then you will be, will be able to select the private repository here from the drop-down list. And after you finish all the operations, remember to click the little tick icon here, then click Next. And here you will see that in Coposphere 3.1, this is a new behavioral strategy for tag discovery. And you can either enable or disable this strategy. Here in this demo, I'll enable this strategy. And also remember to enter the correct path for the Jenkins file. And for the rest of the settings, I'll just use the default settings. Click Create. Go to its detail page. And then you can see once the pipeline is created, the remote repository will be scanned automatically and some of the branches will be running. Here you can click more and select scan repository logs to view the logs in detail. Here you can see the branches are scanned and also the tags are scanned. Here, if you select branches, let me go back. Here, if you select branches, you can see all the branches here and also all the tag branches here. And you will notice that the tag branch uh, will not be running automatically. So if you want to run a tag branch, you can click run here and then select a specific tag for example tag one and hit ok then this tag branch will be running and actually some of the branches should be yeah they just hit the status su success so that you can click the branches that are shown as a success and uh, you can click the show logs button here so that you can view the log in detail here and here so that's all for this demo video hope you enjoy this new feature in Coposphere 3.1 for GitLab multi-branch pipeline. Thank you for watching.